Denver 7 weather action day. A lot of cold and snow still to come our way. We'll start out tomorrow morning at 10 degrees and 7 a.m. and not get much warmer. There'll be snow throughout that entire time and for much of the day tomorrow. High temperature for today was 30. 19 has been the low 73 and 25 below the extremes and 44 and 19 of the averages so far. 0.07 melted out at DIA where it is 19 degrees. We're 21 here at the studios. The I'm going to go on the rise. The winds are east at 20 and that combined gives us a wind chill of three. As far as the weather conditions along the front range, <clears throat> the darker colors, the heavier snows. We've seen those bands kind of come and go picking up a little bit more now up toward the Boulder area and up around the Fort Collins area. And that's where we'll likely see some of the heaviest additional snow coming up tonight and tomorrow. We could perhaps see some spots picking up another six, seven, eight inches of snow on top of what's already fallen. It does drop off quite a bit farther to the west. Now here's the big map across the country. Very cold air in place for us now, replacing the warm temperatures we had yesterday. That's off to the east of us where they're going to have rain and sleet and freezing rain and snow. This low pressure system working its way along the front is helping to keep the snow that we have going for tonight and tomorrow as it drops southward. Snowy and slick by morning. Not much snow to the northwest corner of the state, but a whole lot of cold air up there. 14 below by morning at Craig. At Grand Junction, 14 above. 22 at Durango, 20 at Cortez and Picosa Springs. Some of the warm temperatures will be down closer to 10 in the Denver area by morning and up at Walden 11 below zero Grand Lake zero minus three at Kremlin mainly single digits and teens at lower elevations snowy and slick still some pretty good bursts of snow at 6 a.m. So tune in. We'll have full team coverage tomorrow morning to get you on your way. It'll be snow covered roads and cold by midday that continues into the afternoon. Although the snow is lighter, the temperatures go Nowhere readings just in the single digits and teens for highs across the state. The warmest readings will be southwest in the low 30s across the east just in the teens. Here's the snow late tomorrow that moves away, leaving behind a bitter cold morning for Thursday. Coldest of the season so far. The storm moves out to the east, a real nasty affair with freezing rain from Texas all the way up to New England with this storm. Dry and cold here through Friday and then milder air begins to move in just in time for the weekend. So seven day forecast is 13 for a high temperature tomorrow, seven below Thursday morning. Now the record low for Thursday morning is 18 below, so we won't get anywhere close to that, but we'll only hit 18 above on Thursday. Friday will start at zero, get to 35 Saturday, Sunday back into the lower 40s. Monday mild and dry back up to 52 and next Tuesday 45.